Hello and welcome back again. Today we are going to create this professional looking animation in PowerPoint. Let's get started. First, we will start our design portion by enabling the guides. Create total of 6 vertical guides and separate them by 2 units each. These vertical guides will be like reference to place our design elements. Now right click and choose format background. Select fill as gradient and type as radial pattern. Change the direction and make it a two step gradient. Apply different shades of dark gray color to both gradient stops. Now go to insert tab and select oval shape. Holding down shift key, draw a small circle at first vertical guide. Make it no outline and change fill color to light gray. Create a duplicate of this circle using Ctrl plus D and place it at last vertical guide. Now go to insert tab and draw line joining these two small circles. Change outline color to white and width to 3 points. Go to insert tab and select oval shape. Holding down control and shift keys, draw perfect circle at second vertical guide. Now create 3 more duplicates of this circle using Ctrl plus D with decreasing sizes and place them co-centric to original circle. Make sure all circles are evenly placed. Finally create one duplicate of small circle, place it co-centric and reduce its size. This circle will be for text placeholder. Now we will create glossy effect over bigger circle. Duplicate the big circle and make it no outline. Now remove half portion of this circle by subtracting a rectangle shape. Rotate this semicircle slightly. Now right click on big circle and choose format shape. Make it no fill and apply gradient pattern to outline. For each of alternate gradient stops, fill them with black and white colors.
Now place this semicircle over the big circle and fill it with gradient pattern. Change the direction and make it a two step gradient by removing black color stops. Now change the transparency of both stops until you get desired glossy effect. Select all other small circles and apply auto shadow effect. Reduce the shadow transparency if required. Go to insert tab and select arc shape. Draw an arc holding down shift key and change its outline to white color. Extend this arc to semicircle by dragging its yellow points. Rotate it vertically and making use of format painter, apply same format as that of line. Increase its size by holding shift key while you drag and align it to second vertical guide. Change the colors of all small circles using color palettes. Go to insert tab and draw small triangle at second vertical guide. Make it no outline and fill it with white color. Adjust its size if required. Place the text fields to finalize our design. Now instead of creating duplicates of this pattern, we will proceed to animate all these shapes so that when we duplicate these shapes later, those new pattern will have animations as well. To start with animation portion, enable the animation pane first. Select the left side small circle and apply zoom animation. Select the horizontal line and apply wipe animation. Change the direction to left, start it after previous and set duration to 1 second. Now select right side small circle and apply zoom animation. Start it after previous. Select semicircular outline and apply wipe animation. Change the direction to left and increase duration to 0.75 seconds. Holding down Ctrl key, select all four concentric small circles and apply zoom animation. Start them after previous and increase the duration to 0.75 seconds.
For second, third and fourth circles, increase each delay duration by 0.25 seconds. This will give ripple effect to our animation. Now select big circle and go to more entrance effect. Click on pinwheel to apply that animation. Start it with previous and decrease duration to 0.75 seconds. Also increase delay duration to 1 second. Now select glossy shape and apply wipe animation. Change the direction from top and start it with previous. Increase the duration to 0.75 seconds and delay duration to 1.5 seconds. Now apply wipe animation to small triangle shape and start it after previous. Finally apply zoom animation to both text fields and start them after previous. Let's preview the animation once. That looks perfect. Now select all the shapes and drag them holding down Ctrl and Shift keys to create duplicates. Make sure to drag them until adjacent semicircle outlines align to each other. Now flip vertically few shapes like semicircle outline and triangle shape. Place them as per design requirement. Remember, these duplicate shapes will have animations with it, so you will have to change the direction for triangle shape animation. Now change the colors of smaller concentric circles. Similarly create the duplicates by dragging the shapes holding Ctrl key and change the colors. So here is the final preview. Hope you all liked it. Please don't forget to like, share and comment.